Okay, I'm back. I would say that it's probably been about 45 minutes or something. And I didn't do a good walk around to begin with, but uh, that's all relatively leveled out. And I mean, that was bad. Uh, the disc is done pretty well, honestly. Now, I've got sandy soil. <clears throat> I think if you tried to do what I'm doing here in heavy clay or something like that, you'd be really disappointed because you need some weight on there. Um, I don't know how well you can hear with the wind, but you know, this stuff out here was so rough before and just pockets and pockets of holes, you know. And I've cut this a couple of different directions and it really has helped slice it all up good. This stuff back here was just all sod, especially back here. And this has done a good job of cutting it up and bringing all kinds of crap to the surface. So I'm in a position now where I can get in here with the harrow rake, where before there's no way in hell I could have raked this in the condition that it was in. So. The disc has been able to level things out for me and take some of the humps, you know, the highs and the lows out of these whoop de doos here. And now I can drive it with the rake and I should be able to finish this off with the rake. I spent about 15 minutes picking debris up. You can see this crap that the disc was able to bring to the surface and show me. So, you know, it's definitely, uh, been helpful for sure and uh I mean, this is cut up you can't really see it because there was such high uh and can you see how i can't even find my damn feet you look at how much grass was in here and stuff that's all been sliced up so i don't think that the video does it justice as to how much this has been sliced up now so yeah i mean i don't know i guess on a scale of one to ten ten being holy crap i can't believe how well it worked and one being a total failure you know i probably give it a seven um and this is by far the toughest one that i had to do so that's a one-time deal i got to get it done what i really need to be able to deal with is taking these trails out and leveling them, leveling them off but without something like this to cut that sod apart you're not able to do it I mean I my box blade just grabs sod and the bucket and everything else I mean I should be able I don't care how many times I got to run down the trail just to slice it up good I should be able to use that thing to help me on my trails so yeah, you know, I got like 325 bucks into the disc. I already had the three-point uh, drawbar, so uh, I think I got 322 bucks into the disc, and then another 22 bucks into the extension. So 350 bucks. Um, I'll use that and get my money's worth for sure. So that's kind of where I'm at on my first impression I've got several other food plots I got to do the same kind of a thing on so I'll be back to you later let you know on those how well it's doing what my experience is